Time Lord may be used to fill gaps in your toolkit or become a full drawn animation pipeline. To get a sense of how it might fit your workflow, we'll do a round trip from After Effects. The first button will create a timeline in Photoshop or Animate to match the open comp. The new document will have a matching size, frame rate, background color, and in Photoshop, duration and work area. Inside Photoshop and Animate, the Time Lord panel is a toolbar to help with frame based animation. The first two buttons match what you see in After Effects. This button creates a new matching timeline without switching back to After Effects. The next button will render selected layers and import them directly into After Effects. For more about rendering and how to use Time Lord like Overlord for Photoshop, see the Render Pipeline video. These two buttons extend and shorten the selected frame's duration. The next two buttons roll the end of a frame like a video edit and will adjust the length of the following frame to keep the layer's total length consistent. Each of these buttons will affect multiple frames and holding shift will adjust them by 10 frames at a time. Add new frame creates blank frames immediately after selected frames. Delete selected frame does what it sounds like and the behavior is consistent between Photoshop and Animate. Split frame and clear frame are pretty self explanatory but can be really useful together when adding in betweens. New layer does as the name implies while adding a frame under the playhead to allow for immediate drawing. Duplicate blank layer will copy the selected layer's frame timing but with empty frames to help with cleanup. In Photoshop you'll find a few additional buttons to enable onion skinning, show onion skin settings, and set the selected frame's color. You might already have an established workflow and want to hide some of these buttons. Right click any of the panels to open settings or click the settings button to customize the visible action buttons. You also have access to additional buttons to support specific workflows. Create a new After Effects comp from Photoshop or Animate if you prefer to start projects in your drawing app. Instead of exporting layers, you can quickly import your open PSD or FLA file into After Effects. After Effects will ask if you want to import a PSD as flat footage or layered comp, or where to save Swift files from Animate. Duplicate Frame can help when creating seamless loops. Photoshop also gives you the ability to create a video layer. Photoshop video layers can be simpler than frame groups. They have unique frames for every frame of the timeline and are great for color. Since Photoshop is pixel based, this button will double your canvas size to make it easier to draw clean edges with an alias brush. You can also solo layers in Photoshop and animate similar to After Effects. This has been a look at the Time Lord workflow. I hope this helps you work faster and enjoy the process more. Check out help.battleaxe.co for more info or click learn stuff inside the Time Lord panel.